What's up guys, T-Rex and Mr. God right here, taking you further and faster in your music career, giving you legitimate tips, ideas, strategy on how you can actually take your music to the next level, okay? So if you're new here, hi, my name is T-Rex and on this channel what I do is I give you a lot of music gear, reviews also, tutorials, tips, ideas, marketing strategies about music, okay, on how you can actually get better in your music career. I'm an artist just like you, okay, trying to make it or break it, I guess, alright? So if you got something interesting, you want me to check out your song, or whatever just send it over i'm always interested in hearing all of that stuff and while i'm at it why don't you listen to my own music as well okay i got a new single called all stand strong i got an amazing mixtape that's out there called change nf's change if you love that you are definitely gonna love my okay everything's linked right down below from my website and also apple music spotify all of that instagram is a really nice way for you to connect with me so i encourage you to follow me there okay so you can actually get updates and tips on everything that i do on a daily basis okay so if you're new here all right so welcome to the family join the family of over 2k amazing people right here producers singers songwriters just like you okay musicians all matter stuff just like that okay amazing people right here okay thank you guys so much and also so while you're at it why don't you hit that bell icon so when i do drop amazing videos just like this one you are going to be the very first one to see it so ever since i started doing comparison videos okay just like my at 2020 and the uh, pre seminars um m7s you guys have been asking for a lot more so today i got a really special battle right here for you guys okay so to my right is the Beringer euphoria um2 i could never just remember that name right off the top and to my left i got the pre sonos audio box usb 96 okay so if you guys have been a subscriber to the channel for a while you would know that this is actually what I use on a daily basis, okay? I bought this about maybe two months ago, there about, okay? And I've been using it ever since as well in, you know, side by side along this. I made a review, unboxing, review tutorials using this. Everything's gonna be linked right down below. You guys can check it out if you wanna see. Also, I made an unboxing and review about this. If you wanna see that, it's all gonna be linked right down below. But today, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna give you a quick comparison between these two. Now, um, there's a lot of differences between them. There's a lot of things that you actually need to know. If you're thinking of picking this or this, then you're in the right place, okay? So without further ado, let's dive right straight into it. Alright guys, so the first thing we're going to talk about is the pricing on these two devices and first off, I'm going to start with the pre sonos which you can actually get for about 150 Canadian dollars. You can actually just go through the link right down below if you want to pick this one up for yourself. And for the price, you actually get a really solid device here and you also have an option to get this with a bunch more accessories if you get it with a bundle set. And next we move over to the Beringa, which looking at from their website, you can actually get this for about four or five dollars. And I must give this one to the Beringa here because price wise, you get a really affordable and a very decent audio interface. So that's one to Beringa and zero to the pre -sonos. Now next off, let's talk about the presentation of these two devices when they come in the box. And we start off with the pre -sonos here, which I did get mine with a bundle set, which did come with a whole bunch of stuff like the pre -sonos M7 microphones and the HD7 studio headphones. It's a really amazing set, it's a nice pack. I'm going to link up the unboxing right here so you guys can go check it out if you do want to see it. And also there's going to be a link right down below if you want to pick up a bundle set for yourself, you can actually just go through that link and just purchase it through me. Now when you look at the unboxing video for the Beringer, which I will also just link somewhere up here in the cards, you see it's very basic and it's very simple and for the very cheap price, you do just get the interface itself, okay? And in terms of that, I kind of want to give it to the pre sonos here because if you can just stretch your budget just a little bit more, then you can actually get a lot more accessories with this one. I know it's a little bit more expensive, but at the end of the day, you're actually going to like it a lot better. Alright guys, so a lot of you already do contact me on Instagram and also Snapchat, wherever it is that you feel comfortable with and also in the comment section and honestly, I thank you guys so much for that. You're amazing. You guys are really what makes this channel grow and make it move, okay? But if you guys want to support me a lot more and a lot better, then I suggest you can actually become a Patreon. I'm going to leave a link right down in the description right down below where we can just continue to do what it is that we already do. The only difference is that you're going to be supporting me and you're going to be supporting the channel by becoming a Patreon, okay? Okay, so you can have an opportunity to ask me anything the same thing okay the same tutorials that i do with you guys i do video calls with a bunch of y'all i do tutorials with a bunch of y'all one-on-one -one through instagram and other places okay and we can just continue to do that the only difference is that you're going to be supporting me and you're going to be supporting the channel okay so i suggest you guys check it out tell your friends 
and let's do something amazing all right let's move on so the next thing we're going to talk about is the build quality of these two devices and now first off i'm going to start off with the presonus right here and boy oh my you have an amazing metal design here with a little bit of plastic here and there and there and there's so much weight to this device okay each time i hold it like it kind of feels like i'm holding something that has a lot more quality to it something that's actually really well built it has been over a year now that i've been using this and this device is actually still standing really strong for me so that is a kudos to presonus right there now we move over to the Beringa and as you see as I easily just pick this one up I'm not trying to say it's flimsy or anything but it's a really lightweight plastic design okay the design is so simple it's minimal and it is just all plastic but there is one contradiction here to the build design except for the fact that it is extremely portable I mean this thing is so tiny you can actually easily just fit it into a bag but for the fact that it is so small there's only a part for one input channel which is a kind of a disappointment to me because if you're someone who wants to do vocals and you want to record an instrument at the same time then you're gonna have to look elsewhere because this only has one input channel and that is just a big no-no for me now let's move on to the connectivity okay and one thing i must say is that there is no issue whatsoever with connecting these two devices with every single thing that i use now if you want to know every single thing that i use it's all listed in the description right down below you can actually go check it out but it works with every single thing that i use because i have a really frankenstein setup right here with a macbook pro audio technica and so on and so forth Now we're gonna get down to the part that you guys have actually been waiting for and that is the sound quality. But before we do get into it, did you know I was wearing frames the whole time? Definitely you did know because I actually wasn't wearing frames the whole time. But these are my Jade Blacks as well and can you just look at these are my Jade Black Lucid frames in gold. They come in other colors just like black and silver and all the kind of stuff but look at how amazing and beautiful this handmade crafted italian acetate is. these are actually blue light lenses okay so i spent a lot of time in front of these lights i spent a lot of time in front of a camera because i model i spent a lot of time on my computer because i make music i do a lot of stuff i write a type okay so it's really important that you do protect your eyes okay and if you're thinking of checking these if you're someone actually wears frames you can actually get these prescribed if you want to and we all know how much that actually costs and we all know how much designer glasses designer frames glasses actually do cost they're really expensive okay but j black is offering you this for about way just like this if others are like this their price is like this okay now i can just tell you that for a fact okay so if you do want to check them out first link right below that like button you can actually use my code lack of t-rex and get 10 percent off anything that you do get from the site as long as you follow my link you get 10 percent off and actually you use the code you get 10 percent off okay it's an amazing deal they have a lot of collection right now they got some new stuff that just came in it's really amazing okay so for the sound quality the best way i can explain this one to you guys is spoiler alert i've been recording on the pre sonos all this while okay so this entire voiceover is been on the pre sonos this whole time and if you guys have been subscribed here for a while you do know that the pre sonos just actually gives a really nice punch to it okay so this audio is not edited in whatsoever it has not been touched it's nothing it just goes into studio one and it is exported and brought into iMovie for editing okay so there's no tweaking there's no whatsoever so this is as good as you can actually get but a huge disclaimer here is that due to the other gear that i'm using it does have a lot to do with the sound quality okay so what i'm gonna do right now is i'm gonna switch and actually i'm gonna speak with the bringer so you can actually hear what that sounds like using the exact same thing and exact same settings but the only difference is that it's gonna be the bringer that's gonna be doing all the processing all right guys so at this point i'm actually speaking on the Beringa, and you really don't have to be a rocket scientist to actually see that the sound quality coming out from this is just not as good as that coming from the pre -sonus. okay i really hate to say it but this is not good at all this is really not good if you want to use this audio raw you're not gonna have good results if you're someone who wants to do music it is really muffled there's a lot of echo i try to do as much as i can before i start speaking because i tested this a lot 
but it is really not good okay i stay as far as i can from the microphone but yet the input still seems to be really high that is what is creating a lot of this pitch sounds if you can actually hear it because i can see on studio one right here there's so much echo there's so much pitch even when i don't speak there's a zigzag just going along the line it is really messy honestly so if you're gonna use this i suggest you could you're really gonna have to know what it is that you're doing if you really want to use this device okay so guys if you're looking for a really nice device that you can actually get with a bundle set okay and you're willing to stretch your budget just a little bit more then i really recommend you go for the pre sonos okay but don't just take my word for it okay check out some other videos check out some other content look at the check uh in the comment section right down below listen to what people are actually saying about this okay then you would actually know where to do okay but i suggest if you're on this super tight budget okay and you don't have that much amount to stretch and you kind of have a little bit of stuff lying around i've made a video using my daily microphone as an actual input device and actually using my google home pods as an output okay on speakers all right so it is quite possible if you're on a really super tight budget you can actually grab the Beringa and find some sort of microphone that you can hook up to it on honestly if you can make this work then you can actually make it work okay but i must just say you really need to know what you're doing if you guys want guidance and tutorials on that okay that is why i created the unstoppables okay the unstoppables is the patreon service all right you guys can reach me out there we're gonna have a real in-depth tutorial about anything that you want to ask me about we're gonna figure it out we're gonna make it work okay so i will see you guys around peace out so that's it for me with this video guys tell me any other thing that you want to see something i missed any questions that you might actually have that you want to know okay um i try to keep this as quick and simple as i can be okay i am not biased in any way there was someone who did say i was biased in my last comparison video i'm actually not biased in any way i try my very best to give both devices an even chance okay so if there's something you want to say say right down in the comment section right down below we're gonna have a chat about it okay thank you guys so much for watching if you haven't already smash that subscribe button destroy demolish it hit that thumbs up button because it really helps the algorithm so so good thank you guys so much again so much for watching and i will see you in the next video don't forget guys be unstoppable